so I'm gonna do a hand cam for you guys. I know I did one previous, but this is before the um, this is definitely before the tuning um, ever took place. So the other hand cam video I had of Classic Alt was before they slowed down the movement. So I wanted to show you guys how it bounced. Um, again, like I said in the other video previous, I have a mixture of using left stick, right stick, um, pull back of course, going back into left stick, and it's pretty, pretty easy. Um, <clears throat> since it's Is this what you trained for? I'm gonna show you guys my settings. Feel the boot of your enemy pressed upon your neck. Oh. So I guess I played 28, and I thought I was playing 25. So 28, 25, 28 is what the sense is looking like for now, because I'm probably gonna switch it. Uh, I have a. I changed my sense a lot. Uh, I played 10, 0, 0. Move this out the way. Vibration is on. Um, my Omni is on or off depending on how I feel. If I feel like with it off, I'm slow. I just turn it on and I just feel like my, my bounce is a lot better. It's a lot more cleaner. Um, off my triggers, I play left-handed. And single stick is off right now. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to... I I switch it on and off. Um my control remaps i have nothing remapped on you know playing alternate i play regular classic alt the only things i have swapped is my bumpers so since i play left-handed i would aim with this and shoot with this and with these switched i aim with rb and shoot with lb and it's a lot more comfortable for my hand so i'm gonna show you guys uh the bounce now you was to practice um doing this i'm pretty sure you can get your bounce like this it is pretty easy all you have to do is practice every fucking day or it, does, it doesn't even have to be every day you might want to take a break um because if you are getting in the alternate for the first time it's gonna like this this button you're sp you're not spamming you're actually timing it but like you you get the you, you'll get to the point where you perfectly time it to where it feels like you're spamming. It's gonna tire out your hand, like, a lot. For me, though, um, for doing this for... I've been playing alternate... Ah, fuck. For, like, a year or two. And I don't get tired. It just feels regular. Like, nothing's wrong with my fingers. My, nothing happens to me. Not everybody's the same. I had friends that tried to switch to classic alternate and they talked about ha having uh, carpal tunnel. And, um... Fortunate for me, I don't have that. Um, <laughs> I just keep chilling while bouncing everywhere. Um, I'm thinking about doing a series where um, I'm just playing where I play ranked and have a hand cam and just, you know, talk through the gameplay on um, how to, you know, play certain situations. And then you'll be able to see with my hand cam, you know what I did on the controller and maybe you can learn off of that and learn how to play better. Hopefully it can make you better. Um, you know, I, I just want to help anybody that's new coming to Gears or anybody that's, you know, wanting to get better at Gears. If my gameplay can help you, that would mean a lot. You just chill, take a view, and hopefully you learn something. Um, with that being said though, just remember that all this wall bouncing, <laughs> all this wall bouncing in the world won't help you hit a shot. So if you're like me, um, shit, just hit a shot. I struggle with hitting shots for the sole fact of me playing left-handed. I've been playing left-handed like the whole time I started playing claw, and I can't swap back. I tried swapping back, and like I'm just doing too much to go and swap back. Like if I wasn't competing right now. Um, I would literally swap, but 
Um, I'm dead ass competing right now. There's no point. Like, maybe in the off season I'll swap. But, yeah. So then, I just keep doing my. I want you to know, with the stick, I'm literally holding it up and swiveling left and right. I'm taking this stick and it should look something like that when I'm bouncing. It doesn't look like it perfectly, but in all honesty, their sticks are moving aligned together like that. While I'm holding it down. And if I if I hold this right stick down, right? Um, the reason why I do that is because... It's kind of like getting an angle like bouncing is literally about getting angles That's what bouncing is for me and That's that as what I'm doing and Looking down is actually what helps me do that. I can do it without touching my right stick, but it is a lot harder Eventually I would have to touch my right stick I can definitely left stick, especially if I turned on single stick right now, but um, I might do that in a separate video, a single stick. But you can get to the point where you carelessly just bounce and literally glide around the whole map. Oh, alright, I got ready for the butt. <clears throat> but I have to say it's so uncomfortable. Um, but you can definitely get it to the point where you glide around the map if you practice all you got to do is time it Alternate is definitely not about spamming. It's about timing and Pretty much precision precise gameplay, you know actually suck it right now like so much I don't even know what is my uh, my former teammate bot is doing um sorry that this is gonna be a cut um I definitely suck at editing <laughs> I don't know how to I know how to edit it's just that I don't know how to render my I know how to render my videos too I just don't have to render in the correct quality where it makes it look good um, don't know how to do that. I looked up videos how to do it and shit, but I'm gonna just post a little uncut version and the next video I'll post will be something edited a lot more clean. I just want to show you guys a hand cam of me playing classic culture. Um, oh yeah, another thing, if you did get this far in the video, um, I would like to say, um, you know, please subscribe, comment if there's something you want to watch from me, if there's any type of video, any ideas, um, I do have an idea in mind where I was going to do, you know, hand cams on other Gears of Wars of me playing Classic Ult, you know, just have like a little, you know, series, and, um, I don't remember the other thing. Oh yeah, and I also stream on Twitch. So if you guys could follow me on Twitch and actually, you know, pull up when I stream. I usually stream during the weekdays, um, and Sunday, because I do compete. I have the online tournament on Sunday with uh, my teammates. It's the Challenger series. That would actually mean a lot to me. And again, if there's anything I can help you guys with, just feel free to message me on. Um, you can message me on Xbox, which my gamer tag is literally Zeantre, it's just Z-E-A-N-T-R-E. -E, or you can leave a comment down low and I'll definitely answer. I answer to everyone. Uh, and yeah, pretty much that's it. So, again, 
you guys have any ideas, please let me know. If there's anything you need me to post, I want to help you. To play alternate better, I will do it. I'm probably going to just start the series up. With me uh, wall bouncing on other games on alternate. And hopefully that could help too. Because wall bouncing on... If you can wall bounce on Gears 3 and Gears 4 on alternate, you can damn well wall bounce on here. This game is very easy to wall bounce on. They made it to where it is extremely easy. So, that's going to be it from me. I'm going to catch you guys later. And uh, make sure you subscribe. Again, if you guys would like to follow my Twitch and pull up when I'm streaming, that would actually mean a lot. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. So, y'all be easy.